Ireland has been a member of Interpol since the 40s. Um, international cooperation is ever more essential in combating crime, both nationally and across the world. And Interpol has a key role to play in that, and we're very conscious of that. What I've been discussing uh, with General Secretary Jürgen Stock is the issues in relation to international terrorism, uh, illegal migration, organised crime, uh, cyber crime. No country is immune from these threats. And I believe the time is absolutely ripe for ever more cooperation uh, between our national and international agencies. Uh, we do have to exchange information, uh, share intelligence, uh, have task forces working together uh, to tackle um, this very organised uh, criminal activity that impacts on all our countries. Just recently I attended the uh, European Justice and Home Affairs Ministers uh, meetings uh, in Luxembourg and what becomes ever clearer is the need for us to exchange information in a very robust way uh, to share intelligence in the interests of the citizen in the interest of making sure that our countries are safe. Uh, this applies to a very wide range of areas. If you take the area of child exploitation, for example, uh, we have one of our, our, our own members of our police force working here in Interpol, Michael Morn, uh, as an assistant director in the area of human exploitation and child trafficking. If we are to deal effectively with paedophile gangs uh, across Europe, across the world. Uh, we need police forces sharing information, uh, developing databases uh, to interrupt this heinous crime. And Interpol has a key role to play in that, as do our national police agencies, you know, as I say, working in cooperation. The exchange of information on a specialist uh, basis um, is critical to interrupting criminal activity. And in tackling crime, organised criminal gangs, um, I believe we have to develop more specialisms in our police forces. And one of the key ways of doing that is looking at you know, the expert information that's available to deal with any particular area. And that's very well served by exchanges and uh, officers moving between the forces uh, and Interpol.